not, and I haven't managed to beat night one. Please, come on. I don't know why I keep doing those intros. I, I never even plan what I'm gonna say. I just, I just do them. You know, just talk to Freeman. It's a thing you do now for five nights. Woo! I say five nights. <laughs> I haven't beat night one. Game face. Okay. So I, I looked it up between last episode and this episode, and the cupcake is just uh, Chica's jump scare when you're in the bedroom. Wait, what would Bonnie have then? So yeah, if you fail to scare Chica away, let's just say that, then yeah, she uses the cupcake. And I know I'm going to beat this this time because because I want to. <laughs> you know what? As sad as it is, I tried to look up tips for beating this game. I couldn't find any. I couldn't find any tips other than, you know, the stuff the game tells you is to listen out for breathing, when and when not to use your flashlight. Just just the stuff you know from from playing the game. So yeah. Great. You know what? I'm struggling to beat night one and the stuff doesn't come out till nearly three AM. How the hell am I gonna manage a fully fledged night where shit's coming at you from the very beginning? I don't think I can manage. I don't think it's one AM. It's good. It's good. It's not good. It means we're getting closer to the, the killer stuff. It's just gonna be really bad if I have four episodes up of Five Nights at Freddy's Fall. <laughs> I'm still on night one by the end of it. It's gonna look real awful on me. Real, real awful. I mean, the cupcake. <laughs> what the fuck? And that's the thing. the gibberish. So, I. That was weird, that took a little longer to get there than usual, I thought something was happening. I forgot what I was going to say. So I don't know what to do when, you know, if, when they're in the hallway. Like when they're a distance away, like you know when you... S I had some... the game on really loud on my end. I'm not sure if that comes through in the video. <laughs> I'm really terrified now. I'm really terrified now. <laughs> it's only 2 a.m. Someone played some fucking music somewhere near me. Uh oh, Fran. Okay, check the bed. Out of my way. say anything. I don't want to distract myself, but maybe I should. Okay. Fram still. Four. I don't know what to do. I just panic. I just This is it. Okay. Quickly check the bed. Back to Chica because I think there might be a timer. I think there might be a timer set when you scare them away so they're not as quick to come back. No, 
breathing. Good. I had stuff in the kitchen. I'm not sure if that means anything. I'm not even gonna check. I think it might work like um Five Nights at Freddy's 2 where the flashlight uh, forces them to go away. So maybe what I'm doing wrong is the times I shut the door, when the doors open again, I should probably use the flashlight to keep them away. And that's gotta be what I'm doing wrong. I'm gonna check Barney again. I gotta check Chica because she's gonna be there. Okay. On my way. I'm thinking Chica. Okay, Barney, I know you're coming. I know what it means, but what does it mean in the sense of the game? Fun with plush trap. Hold control to use flashlight. Use flashlight to stop plush trap on the X to skip two hours on the next night. This is different. There's a timer. What do I do? So I got to. I stop him on the X. So I wait for him to move. He's not moving. I only have 90 seconds to do this. God damn it! Keep getting him just as he's moving. Give it more time. Oh shit. <laughs> Creepy as fuck, buddy. time. What do I do? Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Too bad. What does that mean? Did... Okay. Um. Night two. Okay, so I guess I'm not skipping two hours. Oh, gee, that would be really helpful to have, actually, a two-hour skip. I need that. I need that. Oh, Jesus. I forgot what the mouse was. 
Okay, now shit's real. That's different. Never had the door open like that before. Is it just mirrors or more noise? More music. sure when uh, Foxy will come out. I know Foxy's in the closet. I'm sure I've mentioned it before that you can see it in the, um, the pictures on the store page. I'm sure it was in the trailer too. Hey guys, I'm thinking Chica is probably like really active. 1am, we are doing good, we're kicking ass. That was breathing, 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 that was breathing. How do I go hold it? How do I go hold it? Go away! Okay, good. Good, 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 good. I mean, at least I think it was breathing. I heard a noise, it was like, rrr, like a growl. Terrifying. Like, I really hope you guys can hear this stuff. Fuck off, you little bastards. Okay. Check the closet. No idea when Foxy comes out. Will Foxy breathe? I mean, it doesn't... Did it say to check for breathing? Because I never already checked that properly. Whoa. Piss off, buddy. I got your number. The music went out. I don't know if that means anything. just as bad as it did in the first episode. <sighs> My eyes are beginning to water this, this... Jesus fucking Christ. <sighs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think we're done this episode. I mean, we accomplished something. We we beat the first night, finally. Woo! <laughs> I'm gonna stop recording this for a bit. I'll probably record it again in like a few days or so. And none of that matters to you, because these should be coming up in a relatively uh, decent schedule. So there's not gonna be any big gaps like I did with Cry of Fear. If anybody here watched my Cry of Fear playthrough, I feel bad for you. But good at the same time because it was it was great to have people watch if anybody did. But like every now and then I just like I take like a fucking month or a few in between parts. It was awful. Not that anyone was really watching back then anyway. So anyway, I'm rambling about stuff that truly terrified me. I mean, I was like, why did I do that? Why did I put the flashlight? On? I'm an idiot. I mean, I was thinking back to what I was saying not long ago that maybe when you close the door you should flash the light just to keep them away because maybe it works like that from Five Nights to where certain animatronics I think it was just Foxy and Mangle was it? where you just flash the light at them for a, I don't know a couple seconds whatever it was I just kept clicking it and then they go away maybe a flashlight in this sense keeps them away and I guess that's what I tried to do after opening the door which gave me, <laughs> yet again, one of the biggest scares I've ever had. Got me good. This game is great. This nails everything. This is what these games have all needed to be. They've all been good, but this just really hits the fear, the scares. It's great. I love it. It's different because you're not checking on cameras to see where they are. You're listening out the audio cues because you've got to stay quiet and listen out it just makes the jump scare so much more terrifying I love it I love it I'm definitely doing more of this I just need to calm myself down it took a few days or whatever it just 
come back again soon ish <laughs> but anyway thank you for watching if you enjoyed this video please feel free to leave a like and subscribe if you want to see more content from me so it's a nice day stay fabulous and i will see you guys in the next video bye <laughs> There you go, there's your funny face, I've been doing that less lately. Anyway, bye again.